Because uh, it's the, the talent that I have and it's what I love to do the most since I was a kid and uh, I chose football as a profession because I mean football is part of me, it has been in my family for a very long time so I love to be in football. Um, this was when I was about to go into the university after my uh, secondary school, so this was uh, a, di a difficult time for me to decide because I know as soon as I go into the university, playing football is going to be a bit difficult for me, so I had to make that decision to play football, so I, I decided to move on with football. Honestly, I was, I was so overwhelmed. I was so happy because it was something that um, I never saw coming and uh, it was something uh, uh, I was praying for. I didn't know if I, <clears throat> if I had the, 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 the qualities like the, the other guys that I, was, that I was watching then on TV or in the stadium. I'm talking, I'm talking about when I went to Porto, you know, in 2014. So, um, when I went to the stadium to see the players, to see the, the main team players like Klein, Casimero, you know, I was, I was, you know, I was doubting myself if I have the same quality or if I have quality like to play like them and I was beginning to have those doubts. But when I got the contract and when the club told me that they believed in me and the, 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 the belief in my potential, I was so overwhelmed, I was so happy that I got the contract and uh, I mean, it was something that changed my life and my family so I think uh, it's a wonderful thing. Um, honestly, uh, I never saw it coming as well because uh, when I was playing the Porto in the main team, when I had some couple of games, um, I never knew that Nigeria was watching me as well. So I made some important games. I made some, uh, some um, debut in, in photo main team. And I never knew Nigeria was, you know, they had eyes on me. So um, after the game, I had uh, my club telling me that the Super Eagles contacted them, telling them that I'm invited to the Super Eagles. I mean, uh, I was shocked at first, but uh, at the point, I was so happy I couldn't sleep at night because I'm going to represent Nigeria, my country. And uh, yeah, it's an, always an honor to fight for my nation. Um, honestly, I don't have one particular player. I mean, I connect with, I have like five or six that I, collect, that I connected with, you know? So, I mean, uh, like everyone knows, like I'm connected with so much with Kelechi Anacho, Kenneth Omero, uh, Wilfred Ndidi, um, Francis Uzoho, you know, I'm connected with like also Alex, so uh, uh, William Trust Ekong, um, Ola, I'm connected with, you know, most of them, so, but um, yeah. But the most that I'm connected with is Kelechi Yanacho because he's my roommate. So we're always together in the room and you know we have this bond and we have this this time of our own, you know, when we speak, share ideas, share time and you know. So I mean I'm most connected with Kelechi Yanacho because we're always like mostly together. Um, I mean, what I get to understand is as a player, not all the players who are being called can play, you know, not all the players who are being selected can play, just 11 can go into the field, so 
I mean, I try to be professional and, you know, try to be calm and help my team. The team comes first before my individual achievement. So, uh, I try to help my, my team first, you know, have a good training and, you know, have a good training and also uh, help my team uh, in the games. So, I try to be calm as much as possible. I try to not lose my head. I try to, you know, focus on the game, help my teammates in whichever way I can. So I make sure that we get the tax that we all want, you know, we get it done. So that's my focus. Left leg. Nigeria? Nigeria, just Nigerian play, Nigerian ex players or the world? The world, left leg. Um, Roberto Carlos. Right leg. Cristiano Ronaldo. Yeah. Cristiano Ronaldo. Head ability. Sergio Ramos. Ball control. Like first top. First top. Ball control. Babatov. Babatov. Head ability. Lionel Messi. Peace. Mbappé. Both sense, like overall both sense. Andres Iniesta. Okay. <laughs> um, including myself. So, a goalkeeper, Francis Uzoho. Um, the right back, Olaina, the centre back, um, yeah, <laughs> Kenneth Omero, and then uh, left back, uh, and that's in the team And in the midfield, I have Luther in DB, I have a table, and John Michel Obi. And on the right side, I have uh, Victor Moses. I have Kenneth Yanato and Victor of Cement. And Victor of Cement. Um, I mean, uh, that is not something I consider right now but I mean towards the end of my career because right now I'm not thinking of ending my career right now so um, I mean it can be uh, yeah it can be an option for me like towards the end of my career or when I'm trying to retire so uh, I mean it's always good to you know to fall back to my country and you know help promote the league and you know help the, the young ones who are still coming up in football help them also achieve their dreams. Yeah, I think it's also an option for me, but I mean, it's not something I'm considering right now. So, I mean, it can be. Um, yeah, so what my advice to the young players who are, who are striving to, to make it in football, I advise you all to just work hard Work hard every day, believe in yourself, believe in your dreams, and uh, pray, be committed, put your mind in it, and, and uh, yeah, listen to advices, you know, in the pitch, you know, and also try to go everywhere you're going in football, try to go on time. It's important. Thank you very much. <laughs>